Yo guys, Ray Tom Reviews here, back with another video. Now as you can tell by title thumbnail, this one is a big one. Uh, it will be a bit long, but if you do enjoy it, make sure you do drop a like. And in this video as well, I'll be giving away a shirt. So if you come from TikTok, uh, I assume that's why you're watching this video. So if you do want, want to win the shirt, comment below, just that, you know, anything. Comment anything below, drop a like on the video, and uh, I will randomly pick um, maybe two people to win a shirt. Um, I have already sent two people um, some shirts from the other giveaway I did, um, so they've already been sent. Um, so yeah, if you do want to win a shirt, like I said, comment and drop a like. But yeah, this video is going to be quite long, but I'm not going to be putting the shirts on because the video will be even longer. Um, but in total, I think we've got about 18 different items in this haul to open from JJ Sport. Like always, link in the description if you do want to go buy something yourself. The quality on them is always just incredible and I mean, the, for the price, you really can't complain whatsoever. So without further ado, let's get into it. 18 shirts, I think I've got. Maybe there's some other things in there as well. I can't exactly remember. It was a while ago I ordered this. But obviously, for the it's going to take a while to arrive because of the size of the package. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. So this is the size of the package. As you can see, it's absolutely massive. Just get a little look in there with how many items there are. I can't actually remember every single one of these items, so a lot of these will be a surprise to me when I pick them out. Um, I think there are some shorts in here though as well, um, I can see here. Uh, but without further ado, like I said, let's get into unboxing or opening, should I say, all of these. First of all, it looks like we have a pair of shorts. I will get these open. You can actually customize shorts on JJ Sport to put whatever number you like on them. So these are, I believe, these are, it says the Manchester United shorts. Now, I don't know if that's wrong. Yeah, it is wrong. Uh, the tag's wrong, but it is Italian shorts. I was thinking I would never order anything Manchester United, and I did. Or I do remember ordering Italian shirts, uh, shorts. So the tag's wrong, but who cares because the shorts are correct. We've got number 15, which is what I ordered. Uh, it's the shirt I like to wear in football. Um, and we have, as you can see here, the Italian badge lovely uh, embroidered in so item number one was a pair of shorts i will take that so second we've got a polo shirt now this is from Ar uh, an argentinian polo shirt this does match the tracksuit which i did buy if you're from a tiktok you may have seen that video um but look how small that is all of these shirts by the way guys are a medium um but look how smart it's got the three stars updated I'm not going to put it on like I said because it would just take too much time but oh my word that is so smart just a little close-up for you so again we have another polo shirt again it is Argentina but the well a different color it's sort of a lighter blue get a bit of a close-up on there again the three stars are there very very similar to the last one but just a different shade of blue again really really nice I'll quickly breeze over this one because again it's just very similar to the last if you do watch all of this video let me know in the comments which was your favorite item either a pair of shorts maybe a polo shirt or a short uh, or a shirt final polo shirt i believe but it is another polo shirt it is this time a spanish one now this the color on this looks incredible look at that light blue and on the side it's got like this oh, it's got like the Spanish colours from their World Cup shirt this year. Oh, that is so nice. That is very, very smart. Just give it a, here we go. a little bit of a close-up. That is so smart. I can't get over that. that. That is very, very nice. I do recommend these polo shirts, boys. They are so nice. Now, there is a reason I bought these pair of shorts. Not just to wear shorts, uh, you know, because I need shorts. But it is to match. I will be a full kit wanker, as they say. Because this has the number 66. It's the Liverpool shirt, shirt, uh, shirt, shorts for this season's player version shirt uh, kit. As you can see, the detail, it is the player version of the shorts. They do do that. And obviously number 66 with the Prem badges. Uh, so if you didn't know, I have got the Trent Alexander-Arnold shirt with number 66 on the back um, for this year, with a, which is a player version shirt. Um, it is in the wash at the minute, so obviously I can't show you, but I do have it. And um, yeah, this will go very nicely.
Next, we have another pair of sh uh, shorts. I believe this is the last pair. Similarly to the last uh, one, the Liverpool ones, these will match um, the shirt I have. So as you can see, number 10 into Miami shorts will match the Lionel Messi into Miami shirt that I have. Just bend that a bit, um, seems to be folded. But yeah, look at that, it's got the font as well. Very, very nice. Um, yeah, just a nice pair of shorts overall. I rate them quite nicely actually. They go very nice, they look very nice. Let me know if you'd ever buy a pair, a pair of shorts from uh, JJ Sport as well, boys. Because I have. <laughs> now, this next shirt is a very special shirt. Not for me, because I, I like the player, but it's just the fact of what the shirt is, the time period in which the player played for this shirt, and just how iconic this shirt will probably become. It looks very, very nice just from looking at it from the outside, but let's get it open up. Um, I do believe I have two of these, like I have the, um, this version and another colorway as well. But here it is, it is a Santos shirt, and there's only one player that everyone really associates with Santos, Neymar Jr. Now this shirt, is, it's like a polo shirt almost, like the, um, the material, but I mean, just look at everything, the detailing on it. It's got a little um, collar as well. Oh, move this tag out of the way. Um, it's got the badge there. It's got the sponsoring. This is from a while ago as well. Like, I don't know if this is like a new shirt that they've stuck name on the back or this was actually a shirt that he played in um, in his time when he played for uh, Santos. But wow, look at that name, name print at the bottom, number 11. Such a nice shirt. Let me know what you think of this one. Uh, in the comments boys but this is very very nice So next one is again a bit of a retro. Uh, this is from the 2014 World Cup. Um, this shirt, for some reason, reminds me of Andre Schürrle. Uh, well, he obviously did wear this shirt, but I don't know why this he sticks out as to someone who wore the shirt. But here it is. It is the Germany 2014, I believe. I'm, I'm not being silly there when I say that. Uh, World Cup shirt. I do love a German shirt. I've got quite a few now. Um, I just, I think Adidas do a great job with German shirts, but there it is. I think it's the 2014 World Cup one. Really, really nice. Um, but yeah, nice shirt. So here it is, the other shirt I did mention. It is another Santos shirt. It is another Neymar shirt. <sighs> Look at this. Look how nice this is. It's got the Nike uh, tick. Sponsoring, got the badge, and then all these uh, sponsors, I assume, on the side. But if we flip it over, again, name on the bottom, the low, uh, the number. You just can't beat that. How nice is that shirt? It is. <laughs> wow, what a shirt. So, keeping on the retro theme, this next shirt is a very retro shirt, uh, but you do see a lot of people wear it these days. Um, just by this first couple seconds of it, you can probably tell what shirt it is. It is the famous. Netherlands shirt. Now, don't quote me on whatever year it is. I really don't know, but um, we've all seen someone rocking this like at a festival or something. But I mean, I don't blame them. Look how nice this shirt is. Quite simple, as in it's just one design. Um, well, no, it's not a simple design actually, would you say? It's quite a hectic design, but it's so nice. It's got the three stripes obviously running down the sort of elbow area, forearm, um, not forearm bloody tricep area um but yeah we've got the badge as well if i get a close-up on that and then the adidas badge as well uh, definitely will be rocking this one um it's a shame the summer's about to come to an end but i wear football shirts all year round so i should be all right wearing this so another retro i do like my retros uh, as you if you couldn't already tell this is from 2006 it is a france shirt 
It is, and I'm assuming it's a way, it's an away jersey. Um, for some reason, JJ Sport have packed in a big, infinite amount of paper mache things. But I just want to get off straight away. This sort of template of Adidas shirts is so nice. I've got a Liverpool one um, with it, and I think I've got a German one as well. And it's just, it's so, so nice. I really love it. Like, look at this front shirt. How nice is that? Get a little um, close up for you. Um, well, let me see what that says. What does that say? It says Coupe de Monde 2006 finale. So I'm assuming it's the World Cup final for 2006, uh, in which France must have played in. Now, Unfortunately, I don't know who won that. I'm assuming France did, but I'm probably wrong. Um, but yeah, what a nice shirt that is. Very nice shirt. I really do like the colours on this shirt. And the pattern across that middle bit there. Oh, very, very nice. Holds my favourite player ever on the back of it. And what an iconic shirt this is. Probably the year that in recent times Barcelona peaked. Oh, what a shirt that is. We even got like the official tags and everything here, Barcelona tags. And of course, there's only one man I could get on the back. Lionel Messi, the year that him, Neymar and Suarez, that iconic front three, won the Champions League, if I'm not, if I'm correct, if I'm correct. 2015, I believe this is. Oh, what a shirt. I just, I can't get over this. This is so, so, so nice. And even the, the name printing as well is perfect. It just looks unreal. Giving me some flashbacks, I tell you that. Neymar, when he had like his little Mohican sort of, not Mohican, it was like sort of shaved and like whatever. Um, but yeah, you all know what year I'm talking about and you all know this shirt. So, next pair or, or item is, what is this? Oh, it's another polo shirt. Tell a lie, guys. I did get another polo shirt. It's just a different colorway to the other one. We still got the same sleeving um, bit as the previous one but it's just a darker shade but again very very nice this goes very well with my tracksuit that i've wear that i've got um i've got a spanish and argentinian tracksuit if you didn't know from jj sport as well um but yeah very very nice shirt or polo shirt sort of item training wear let me know what you think of that in the comments i'm quite liking the polo shirts and what are from jj sport they are impressing me, I will say that. Next, we have a league that we've not visited yet in this video. It is Netherlands. The, oh, sorry, the league that is. Eredivisie. It's Ajax. Now, this is their home shirt for this year. Very, very nice shirt. I did decide, you know, why not get the Champions League patch on the side. Um, but yeah, this, this shirt, I think it's a little underrated. I've not really seen many people online speak about this shirt. Um, I mean, I may be wrong. People may be bloody balling their eyes out about this shirt but I've not seen many people but I think this shirt is unreal look at that I just think it's so so nice like it's, it's a bit plain but the simplicity of it just makes it so nice Ajax do always smash their kits to be fair and again they have done a wonder here because this shirt is incredible now I said the last shirt I didn't think had much hype but this shirt here I've seen plenty of hype for it and this is why I've gone for it this shirt might be voted shirt of the season. I don't know if it will, but there's a chance it will because this shirt, <laughs> incredible. Look at this. All these patches as well come as legit as they come. Got the sponsor on the side. We've even got the blooming league. What was it? Liga Portugal on here. Buin. When was the last time we saw Buin? Um, back in the Madrid days in La Liga. I think. Um, yeah, if I turn it around as well, all the little details literally are on this shirt. 120 years, so obviously this is an anniversary shirt. Is it 120? Yeah, 120. It's got uh, Sagres, whatever that means on the back. <sighs> but look at this shirt. The colorway on this is unreal. Benfica has smashed it out of the park this, and this is definitely one of my favorite shirts. Now, this next shirt is another new seat up current season shirt so the 2023-2024 it is a player version shirt and this shirt is a very very nice one it is boss's new shirt it does remind me of the one we've just looked at the 2015 one it is very very heavily inspired i believe because 
that is virtually the same. But again, it is still very nice. It's a player version one. We get the Barcelona tags here like so. I've gone for the patch on the side. So we've got the Champions League. And as you see here, it's even got the number of how many times Barca have won the Champions League. On the back, Pedri. I didn't really know who to go for. I wanted to go for someone, but I thought I'm a midfielder. I enjoy watching Pedri play. He's a very good player. So why not go for Pedri? Um, and yeah, this is a very, very nice shirt. So we return to Liga Portugal for the next two and final two shirts. Um, yeah, I do think they've come with some good shirts so far this year, uh, for this season. This is Sport in Lisbon. Just a bit of a different one. I don't have, just looking behind me in my rack over there. Don't believe I have a green shirt. Or oh, I have got some green shirts actually, but not many. Um, similar design on the back, obviously, to the um, Benfica shirt. We've got the patch on the side as well uh, for Liga Portugal. Um, but yeah, look at this. It's quite a smart shirt, I think. Let me know what you think of it. It's a bit of a different one, bit of a rogue one, but I think it's all right, actually. It's a nice shirt. Um, and it's a bit different. So this is the final shirt. Like I said, it's Liga Portugal again. It is Benfica again, as you can see, and this time it's their home shirt. I think Benfica have smashed their shirts out of the park this year. Um, obviously we've seen the away one previously, um, but this time we've got the home one. The quality of this, and out of the park, I mean, we've got the Benfica tag, as you can see there, but just this shirt, wow. I just like feeling it. Obviously you can't really tell that, but and you see all the stuff on it, the details they've added. JJ Sport, you are just incredible. Look at this. Got the 120 years again. Got the sponsor on the side. We've got Liga Portugal again. Wow, what a shirt. This is a very, very nice shirt. It's got the gold on the side as well. I'm assuming this means they won the league as well last year or something along those lines. Um, but yeah. What shirt that is. I think some of the shirts I've bought in this in this haul are incredible. Let me know what your favourite one was in the comments below. So yeah, that was the video, boys. Let me know what you think of it in the comments below. Let me know your favourite shirt, like I said. I'm going to have to try and find some space over there on my rack. Um, I'm going to need some more hangers as well. I don't think there'll be enough room in there, to be honest. But it is what it is. Um, but yeah, drop a like on the video. Comment something if you do want to be entered into the shirt giveaway to win any shirt like this. You do get to choose the shirt you want from JJ Sport. Um, and yeah, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate the support. Thank you for 300 subs as well. Much appreciated. Uh, we've had a great start to this YouTube channel. Um, so yeah, onwards and upwards from here. Hope you did enjoy this video and I'll see you in the next one, boys.